Idol auditions came back to the Mile High City, and as the judges stepped out for the first time since Paula announced her departure, the mood was somber. Well, I'm kind of in black because I'm mourning. I'm mourning her um, leaving the show. She was, you know, really the heart of the show, was incredibly nurturing to the contestants, and was like that for me last year. I'm really sad. Like, I was looking forward to her m even more so than Simon and Randy, just because she's like, she, you can count on her to be the nice one. It's like I love Paula, and I think she's like, she's like, she's like kind of the one that brings you up. After eight years together, Paula's presence will be missed. Me and Ryan and Simon and her started this journey together, so really shocked and really sad and really just couldn't believe that she's not here, but, you know, we love her. I'm sure she's going to be great, whatever she decides to do. So it's, it's a little different coming to the show without her. You never want to see anybody leave something like this. Um, so we wish her the best, and we love her. We always will. She was like my best, best buddy, really, on the show. And they only realize how much you miss somebody when they're not there. Um, but I'm sad. But in Denver, guest judge Victoria Beckham, a.k.a. Posh Spice, did her best to keep it up. And to be part of it is just great. I don't know if I'm nervous or excited, but my heart is about to jump out my throat, so I guess that makes me nervous, right? And this year, Simon has a foolproof way for contestants to move on to the Hollywood round. Suck up to me, really, at this point. <laughs> All right. No, it is There's no word yet on whether Beckham will become a regular fixture on Idol, but her kids were a little confused about her trip. So they really thought that I was going to be standing up and singing, but not that today. Next stop, Beantown. In Denver, Alicia Acuna, Fox News.